The Witching Herbs, 13 Essential Plants and Herbs for Your Magical Garden by Harold Roth. So, this book just focuses on the 13 plants that are suggested on the title. So, Poppy, Clear Sage, Yarrow, Rue, Hyssop, Bourbon, Mugwort, Wormwood, Thornapple, Wild Tobacco, Henbane, Belladonna, and Mandrake. So, and... Each chapter is set up the same way, like he said in the introduction that each chapter is divided into three sections, lore, practice, and in the garden. And and he mentions like in the introduction as well, like the lore and what he said in some books, he's like, that didn't happen to me, <laughs> kind of thing, or, oh, I had a good year where this person didn't and all this other stuff. So, and he's been working with plants since like the 1980s. He's been gardening since the 1980s. So, over 30 years of practice and so, and an in-depth exploration of 13 essential plants and herbs most closely associated with witchcraft. 13 because it's the witching number and reflects the 13 months of the lunar calendar. So that's what it says on the back there. Uh, it's a Red Wheel Weiser book. Uh, like, I don't know why I say the publications because some people like a certain publication and some people don't like that publication, so... <laughs> there you go. It's the Red Wheel Wiser book, so. And he wrote, like, he mentions, like, what I've read and what I've seen other people do doesn't really match up to what he has done. So it goes through, like, different types of seeding slash sprouting of, like, the little seedlings and to the final product of whether it's an annual, biannual, or pre-annual pre -annual, uh, plant. So I'll, he does talk about those three in three of the plants because the first three are examples of, or an example of each one. So he'll go through that. So there's a variety of information and things to do with the plant, whether it's making like a pouch or a certain type of food or drink. And it's a mix of like how to grow the plant and info. Uh, so this is what like the title page of the chapter would look like. It would give the title and a keyword, I guess. So, thorn apple offering and uh, like kind of like a sketch of it. And you'll have like little, these are like the little side notes kind of thing. And randomly, ah, there you go, you'll have warnings. Like if you're like pregnant or whatever, don't do this type of thing. So, it will have like some information like this goes through like history and like placement of like here in Europe or in Africa or whatever and then I'll go into like the lore and like different things about it practice so this one's a jelly and uh, how to do it um, and then in the garden. So it, it's not like a textbook, it's kind of like here's some information about these 13 plants and if you have a few to all of these, whether you grow them yourself or like purchase them, this goes into specifics of these 13 so, it's more of, toward, it's more directed to, to those who intend to grow them 
themselves but you can but if you don't grow them yourself you can get some information about them in the book and just bypass the garden part but it's it's an interesting look on 13 specific it's not a general overview of like here's 60 different plants and here's snippets of each there's a dedicated chapter to each plant which is nice if you want to go more specifics and have that physical type thing and it, it is a recent release yeah 2017 so it's not that old like of a release date but yeah the witching herbs by harold roth happy readings